Welcome to Tech Tips. Remember when you were in high school math and you thought, I'll never use this stuff? Well, as a flooring contractor, you do need to know some math. One gallon will cover 1,604 square feet at one mil. So if you could take a gallon of any liquid and get it to be one mil everywhere and spread it out evenly, it would cover 1,604 square feet. Why is that important? Well, if I'm on a job and I know I have a floor that's 1,604 square feet and the manufacturer says, oh, uh, put it down at five mils or let's say eight mils. Eight mils, we can simply go to our 1604 and divide that by eight mils. And what we end up getting is a little over 200 square feet per gallon, okay? So now we know at eight mils, we're at 200 square feet. Now, this is theoretical. It doesn't take into account what's left in the can. So I like to throw in another 10%. And so I figure, all right, real world, I'm gonna take out 20 square feet. So I'm gonna figure 180 square feet per gallon in my estimates. Conversely, if the data sheet says uh, the material is 80 square feet a gallon, and I want to know how many mils it's going to be so I can check it with, with a wet film gauge. So to find this out, we take 1604 and we divide it by the suggested cover rate per square feet, and we come out to about 20 mils. Okay, now I can take my wet film gauge and I can mark it off as a QC method. I can also put some tape out at about 80 square foot a gallon and double check it to make sure I'm getting the appropriate thickness onto the floor. Now that we know our spread rate and the wet film thickness that we're putting this material on, we want to calculate what our dry film thickness is. So if a gallon of paint is 50% solids by volume, not by weight, but by volume, we know that 50% of this can of paint is going to evaporate into the air. It's gone. So if we put it down at the 20 mils we just talked about and half of that goes away, our dry film thickness is going to equal 10 mils. The contractor should know how to quote the job right. He should also make sure that he's giving the customer exactly what he promised or what the specification requires. If you have any questions, contact Rocktread or go to our website, www.rocktread.com.